Affinity Photo offers the ability to edit metadata, both when developing raw files and when editing existing images or documents. Here is a quick guide for both of those scenarios. When developing raw files in the Develop Persona, you have a panel at the top right here, the Metadata panel. This gives you a readout of the EXIF data with specific camera settings. But you can also change the category and look at general file metadata, IPTC metadata, which is predominantly for press applications like newspapers, copyright information, and then we have a detail option. This breaks down the metadata into categories. And finally, there is also the raw data option, which allows you to see all of the metadata in its raw markup language format. Now we can very easily add or modify metadata. Let's start by moving over to the file option on the drop down. So here we can enter some basic information about our image. For the title, for example, we might put leader of the pack. The author would be myself, James Ritson. Author title would be Mr. And the description might be a group of lemurs with a fearless leader. Description writer would be myself again, James Ritson. And for keywords, we can separate keywords with semicolons or commas. So we could put lemur, comma, wildlife, comma, nature, comma, telephoto, comma, close-up, comma, group. And we can also rate the photo. For this one, I might give it four stars out of five. Across on the rights category, we can add some contact information and also define a copyright type if we wish to share this image. Now we have a general copyright and we can declare whether an image is in the public domain. And we also have Creative Commons options down here. I might want to share this image under the most recent Creative Commons Attribution license. So I will choose the CC BY 4.0. Then I can also enter my website for the attribution URL and my name for the attribution name entry. If I now develop this image, that metadata is all stored in the document and is exported with the final image. For example, if I choose to export using this option here as say a JPEG or a TIFF. Now we might have another scenario which is that we want to add metadata to an existing image or document. I've opened this out of camera JPEG here, which means we're not in the develop persona, but rather we're in the main photo persona instead, and there is no immediately visible metadata panel. We need to expose this panel as it's not shown by default. To do this, we can go to view, studio, and enable metadata here. Now we have our metadata panel, much the same as we did for the raw image, we can add our relevant metadata. So across on the file category, we'll title this image Pensive. The author again is James Ritson. Author title is Mr. The description would be two baboons quietly survey the activity around them. The description writer is myself again, and for keywords we might put baboon, comma, nature, comma, wildlife, comma, telephoto. And again, I'll rate this image four stars. So across on the rights category, this time we won't use a Creative Commons license and will instead stick to a general public domain copyright. So we can check this option and enter a website URL here as well. And once we're finished, this metadata will now be stored both in the Affinity document when we save it, and it will also be exported with any export format we choose, again, such as JPEG or TIFF. So there we go, a very quick guide on how to add and edit metadata in Affinity Photo. Thank you for watching.